What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Katrina. Today we are doing a social media plan with me for the week of October 19th through the 25th. I figured I would use some stickers from Color Story and go with a black and white theme because, you know, you can never go wrong with black and white and since it's technically somewhat of a spooky season because of it's Halloween, I figured, you know, Black is suitable. So I always love starting off my week with like positive quotes and stuff. And that's why I love Color Story and specifically all these different stickers because they're just so positive. So on the 19th, I just figured, you know, you got this is such a great reminder because you do got this. And no matter how, what obstacles come your way, you can overcome them. And I absolutely love it. And then on Sunday, that sticker, just do your thing. It's just another, you know, positive reminder to own it, have like the confidence to go after what you want. And yeah, so I just love that when I open up my planner, I'm able to see these positive and uplifting stickers to motivate me. Anyways, I will interrupt this air video to just do a quick little reminder if you haven't subscribed please consider hitting that subscribe button below i would love to have more followers and people join in this community to just you know share creativity and you know get some ideas follow me on instagram too give me a um give me a quick message and i will definitely follow you back because i love seeing everyone um in the planner community what they're coming up with and honestly looking at your ideas and what you put together motivates me to you know try something new with my own individual planner anyways so as we continue forth with this plan with me i'm also taking out some stickers from the agenda 52 sticker pack because they have some cute little pieces you can find the agenda 52 sticker pack at Hobby Lobby and um, yeah they always have some sweet deals on them I think I got this sticker pack for five dollars and yeah so on um, this little weekend banner I'm gonna put this here on Saturday and Sunday I don't know what I'm doing necessarily this weekend. It seems like it's going to be such a slow weekend, but I know I'll figure out something. My husband has drills, so my mom and I are going to stay home with the kiddos, and I don't know, we're probably going to do some Halloween crafts, let them paint. I'm thinking of buying a pumpkin to have my two toddlers paint and decorate and after you know all of that fun we'll probably cut into those and make some pumpkin empanadas if you're not familiar with what an empanada is oh my goodness it is so good so what you can do is you can get pie crust and like cut it into like a small little circle and then fill it up with the uh pumpkin filling now i you know how to make the empanada it's the pie the pumpkin filling that I don't necessarily know how to make my grandma typically makes it um, for me so I'm gonna definitely have to get that recipe but I know there's cinnamon in it and it just make it's not like pumpkin pie it is completely different it's more like a like a jelly type texture but it's so good so I will definitely have to get that recipe <laughs> as you can see my cat Oliver decided to make a grand appearance he just loves hanging out especially when I'm trying to film some plan with me videos that's just his thing a-okay though I still adore him and I <laughs> even though I can't see um, I usually just try to work around him because I don't have the heart to move him but Oh my gosh, he's like such a fluffy little fur ball, and I just, gosh, staring at him. I absolutely love it. Let me know in the comment section below if you all ever have to um, move your animals or if they're ever really in your shots. I just love animals. I wonder if it's common and if people like either edit it out or they just you know refilm 
I I like to leave it raw and in, in there because I feel like, you know, he's there, he's part of my life, and it's awesome. So continuing on with this plan with me, I really love this quote on Wednesday, the dream it, um, then do it quote, because it's just like, it applies to so much in life. You can apply it to, you know, your fitness goals, your creative goals, your work goals, school goals, all of that. One thing in particular I really did was apply it to school goals. You know, back in high school, I never thought that I would continue on with my education and get my master's. And, you know, slowly that developed over the past few years where, you know, I was inspired by others around me. So I am going after my master's now. And even though I say I'm finished with school and I don't see myself wanting to continue I think I do. Deep down, part of me wants to definitely try attempting that PhD, but I don't know. We'll see. It's one of those things we just have to, like, really consider and see all the options. I would love to get a PhD in marketing, but I don't know. It's just with everything going on right now, I don't know if that's like the best option. But the beauty with education, you don't have to necessarily pick and choose right away. You can take your time. So anyways, and that's kind of leads me into my Thursday sticker, the whole one day at a time. It can be one day at a time. You don't have to necessarily, you know, dive in and, you know, commit to everything right away in one space specific second you can you know ease your way into it take one day at a time and see in the long haul if this is like a route you want to go and like I said it can apply to anything it's just one of those things like you just have to like pick and choose and whatnot so yeah that's what welcome to my TED talk I swear I feel like every single week now I've been you know leading into some sort of little TED Talk type spiel. So this sticker right here putting on when I'm putting on Wednesday and on Saturday, I grabbed that from my sip Simply Lovely sticker book. I absolutely love the elegance of the stickers, um, how they have those cut edges and it's just so cute, so simple and so um I don't know, it just it's dainty. And that's what I love about it. And I just love how everything is coming together and yet how the pop of color of the um of the numbers and the pumpkins on the side, it's just it fits very, very well. I'm not too sure if I'm going to um use a black pen when I fill out the spread or if I'll act Actually use like a yellow or an orange to really pop in on that color. I'm on the fence. I I'm probably will go with a black pen because, um, yeah, I always use a black pen. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm even debating that. It's very very common that I don't venture out in regards to my pens, but yeah. I really love how each week I'm using more and more stickers and I'm getting more comfortable with having, you know, more space, there's space being utilized and stuff and I'm just, I'm just really happy seeing the involvement of my different, um, my different planner spreads like it from when I first started to now there is such a difference and that's the other beauty about this planner community you can see grow to with other people and see how their styles have changed and that's what I love about it so I am working my way up to the end the big um, rainbow spread I've seen that a lot with so many people I haven't done it just yet but I'm hoping that you know I get the courage to do it because it does seem very very interesting here on my sidebar of course if you follow me I'm doing my whole social media tracker I track my main YouTube channel this channel as well as Instagram and then I'm going to revive my blog very soon. I just finished school so I will be 
putting together everything necessary to, you know, be consistent on that um, outlet of creativity. But I am having a blast over on my main channel for the 31 days of Halloween because it is fun. I've been doing recipes, I've been doing um, makeup tutorials, hair tutorials, um, just mini shopping hauls. It's a variety of things. Anyways, that's pretty much it. Thank you all for tuning in. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!